Hi my loves, welcome back to my channel. So today's video is going to be an update on my 2020 project pan. And I'm just going to be real with y'all. Um, it's not going to be much progress. I will be um, rotating one finished item out for a new one. So yeah, if you guys are interested in seeing where I am on my pretty much halfway mark, over halfway mark of um, an update with my project pan, then keep on watching. Alright, so if any of you are new here and are new to Project Pan, pretty much it's just you going through anything you choose. I choose makeup items to actually use up your items. Um, either you want to hit pan or completely use up that product and it's like a year. Sometimes they just have like different smaller challenges that doesn't last a whole year, but mine, it lasts a whole year. So, yeah, I'm here to show you all my updates. But I guess first I'll show y'all um, the items that I've already finished, which has only been two items where I hit my goal on. The first one, you guys knew that I wanted to complete this uh, Tarte li little mini liquid lipstick. I completely finished that. It's dried out. Nothing else in here, even though it looks full. There's nothing else. I also hit pan on this um, bronzer right here. I got a good, big old pan. I've still been using this. I still like this palette. But I did reach my goal on that. So those are the two items. And now the third item that I completely finished is this um, Fenty Beauty Gloss. As you guys can see, I did not take the stopper out. Because sometimes it's hard for me to take the stopper out. So I don't care to do that. This is finished. As you guys can see, there's nothing else in here. And I absolutely love this. This is my favorite. I already do have another one, but it's in a little mini. So I have a mini one of those. And what I'm bringing in to replace that Fenty gloss, actually another Fenty item, and this is the little Fenty uh, lipsticks that they have. This is a mini one, and this is in Thick, the Mademoiselle lipsticks this is in the shade Thick. I did have this on earlier today, then it came off because I had to wear my mask while I was out, and now I have on something else. But um, this is what Thick looks like. I'll do a swatch pretty a nice everyday color I definitely think I can get this done because it's not much product in this little mini at all so I can definitely uh, complete this probably I don't know if I use it every day for probably within 30 days if I use it every day so yeah this is replacing the Fenty gloss bomb and as you guys saw my last update I I um entered this into the project pan and it was down here so I had pretty much already finished it so that was an easy win with that one all right so that's being transferred in and that's literally the only thing that I finished so let me go ahead and show y'all what um my progress on my other items so as you guys can see I'm not really wearing any makeup today I just have a mascara and a lip product and that's pretty much how I've been um what I've been doing this whole summer pretty much so I haven't really been using much makeup I did use this as a base for my eyeshadow on my birthday, so I have the Mally Eye. I've used this a couple of times. This is the third or fourth update, so here I am. Mind you, this did break, so a little bit of it broke off, so that helped me get jumped from here to here. But yeah, that's where I am, So, and the lines start from the little rings. So I still have quite a bit left, and I'll just roll it up and show you guys so you guys can see how much product so it's really not that much I'm definitely gonna meet my goal of completely using this before the end of the year if I definitely go hard with using this I could probably use it within like the next two months maybe so yeah that's an update on that the Burt's Bees uh, chapstick y'all know I don't really like this that much and I'm almost done I'm not gonna roll it up because it's hard to put it back down but um this is the first up the, the intro where I was and now I'm all the way down here so I've been doing been consistent with using this because I just put it on in the morning and then wipe it off and put on my lipstick I use this to moisturize my lips and that's it I don't like how the color looks but yeah I've been doing good and I'm almost done with that so I could probably have that done within the next two months because I'm doing every other month next we have the essay edit pore stick and I honestly did not use this we're pretty much still in the same spot. So I still have a lot to do to use with this. And I'll show y'all what the pore stick looks like. I like this because it's supposed to get rid of your pores. This is how much I have left. So yeah, we still have a long way to go with this. 
Heck like, yeah. And that's all I have for the notebook. All right, so now next we're moving on to my favorite. You guys know I love this. this is the uh, Essay Edit Beam Team Hydrate and Glow. The reason why I haven't been using the pore stick is because I've been using the heck out of this. I feel like I'll get more use with the pore stick in the fall and the winter time. But um, yeah, so this is where I started, and now we're all the way down here. So we're probably even lower. It's probably like right here, to be honest. Yeah, we're even lower. But I did use some today, so. We're actually right here, so, but I'll do that next update, but um, when I marked it, this is where I was, so, pretty good progress, and this is easy to use, because I use it like I use it today, and I'm not wearing any makeup, and yeah, and then also, we have the um, highlighter in here, and I'm starting to see, like, something, an indentation, where I may be getting to the bottom of the highlighter, I don't know if you guys can see, I'll have to take a picture so you guys can see it up close, but yeah, there's something under there, so I think I'm about to hit pan, and I want to completely use this up, yeah, and I also have on the highlighter today, don't know if y'all can see where that's at right there, I like to use it on bare skin, alright, so next we have my, um, Maybelline is this Maybelline yeah Maybelline the 24-hour foundation and warm sun y'all know I don't really like this I can't really tell where I am I do see it settling right here so I don't know if that means I'm right here or I could be all the way up here I don't know but I marked it here where it's settling it and I think that's where I am I used it maybe like twice the past two months so like I said I haven't really been wearing makeup like that so maybe I'll get more wear winter and fall, fall and winter. But we're still going on that. Next we have this um, CoverGirl. This is another foundation that I use just to clean up my brows. I literally only have this little section right here and that's it. So I'm definitely going to be done with this before my next update. So I have something to uh, switch out and use once I'm done with this. That's going to take this place and that's going to be the Lorac. Um, behind the scenes I think eyeshadow primer and I'm about right here so pretty much almost full I want to use this because I had one before and it dried up and got old so I don't want to let another one go to waste so I'm going to use this for whenever I do eyeshadow to get that out because I really don't be using eyeshadow primers anyway so we're just not going to let that one go to waste Next, another one that I may be finished with that I did not bring anything to take its place is the NYX um, eyebrow thing. I want to completely use up the edges. That's all that's left, and I'm almost done, pretty much. I'll be done before the month is over. I did not bring anything to rotate and bring in. I'll just update y'all next update and let y'all know what I wrote in and show y'all progress Another item I probably did not use, if I used it, was probably like once. Oh, and I just broke it. Great. Great, I just broke it. This is the Tarte Blush. I've been doing very poorly on this. The design is still on the blush. That lets you guys know that I have not been using this. I, my goal is to hit pan on this, and it don't look like I'm anywhere near, so I definitely need to use this. I just feel like um, it shows up ashy on me. So I think that's why I don't wear it. Maybe I should mix it with something else. Maybe it will look, yeah, I don't know. It just shows up a little bit ashy. So we have this eyeshadow in 24 karat, another one that I'm just trying to hit pan on. I'm gonna be honest, I didn't use this. It's still the same thing. You guys do see the indentation that was on last update and I haven't used it since. I believe I have two more. This pressed powder, I used it a couple of times. Still no indentation, still pretty much the same, not much has changed with this. I really don't know how I'm going to use that up, but I really need to use it. Last but not least, we have my um, ColourPop Lip Liner in K. I have a love-hate relationship with this. I did, um, this is where the pencil is right now. It's very tiny. I did uh, sharpen it today. It was actually more left in there than I thought when I first rolled it in last update. So it's a little bit more left in here. But I'm almost done with this. It's like this gets on my nerves because this comes out. It's like having a really a bad relationship. Like <laughs> it's irritating. You know it's not good for you, but you're not ready to let it go yet. But I'm gonna use this till the wheels fall off. So that's pretty much it 
for my Project Pan update. I'm doing very poorly. I was dreading recording this video because I haven't been using my products that well. But, you know, I'm going to do my goal is to do a lot better to actually try to use these every time I do my makeup. Which means I need to actually do my makeup. So, yeah. That's pretty much it for my update. I hope you guys enjoyed it. Comment down below if you guys are trying to use up anything, whether it's perfume, which would be fun. if Because you guys know I've been like really in, into doing perfume videos, body care items. I have a million body care items. I definitely should be doing Project Pan for body care. I feel like that would be too easy. But yeah, I don't know. So um, comment down below if you have anything that you're trying to use up, whether it's makeup or perfumes, body care, leave them, leave them down below. And if you make Project Pan videos, send me to your video because I need some motivation. I love watching Project Pan videos and seeing the progress that people have made on panning and getting rid and actually using up their items that they're trying to get rid of. So. Yeah, leave that comment down below. I love you guys. Don't forget to subscribe. Make sure make sure you hit the notification bell and hit all so that you're notified of everything that I upload. And I'll see y'all in my next video. Bye.